Hiya guys, welcome back to FYP TV for a new season of Crystal Palace football content. My name is Brett, I run a channel called 2FC. Check it out in the description if you want. Follow me on social media if you want. Make sure you subscribe to FYP TV. That's a definite, definitely do that. First game of the season, at home to Huddersfield. And these are my points, reactions. Not sure if it's more of a reactionist. We lose at home, 3 0, to the newly promoted Huddersfield Town Football Club. We looked poor, very, very poor, very, 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 very poor. Bar, Fosu, Mensa, and Ruben Loftus Cheek. Yeah, that's basically the only two that I've got anything for that did really well, personally. Um, if it wasn't for both of those guys, we probably would have lost 5, 6, 7 now. Personal opinion. But this is what it's about. Watching Palace do the same continuous things. Mm. we need to do something different against Liverpool because if we play like that we are yeah we're going to get demolished but as I said on my channel it's only the first game of the season if we're 10 games in and we're without a win without yeah without a win then we start to worry but as I said trial and error Try different players in different positions. Well, maybe not in different positions, but try different formations where those players are more suited. Try that. I um I did a mock uh, team that I thought could be really good for the Liverpool game on my Twitter account. Go and check it out um, and let me know what you think. I think it's pretty good, personally. I think it's pretty good and it would work. But we can definitely say that the 3-4-3 uh, three, three definitely didn't work, did it, on uh, Saturday. Whoops. But, again, first game of the season. Yeah, well done to Huddersfield. I, I'm not taking anything away from them. They played really good. Really, really, really good. Really well, really good. You know what I'm trying to say. Uh, the link that I was watching only started, but... 30 seconds before they scored the first goal, so maybe I shouldn't have bothered watching, <laughs> and uh, we might not have gone 1 0 down straight away. But um, corner comes in, uh, goes to the back post. Not sure, I think it was Jorgensen, Jorgensen, uh, as a shot, really miscues his shot, hits Joel Ward, goes in the back of the net, we're 1 0 down. Not a great start to the season, eh? But three minutes later, and Moy again. Moy was the one who took the corner. Moy has Moy crossed his ball into uh, Mounier, uh, who fantastic header. Jumped uh, Rider World, Rider World, jumped out, jumped in. Um, just absolutely fantastic header, bottom left corner. There's nothing, nothing he could have done about it, bar the defender actually trying to do some defending. Um, but it was a fantastic header. I'm not taking anything away from the goal. It was great. We had a couple of things in the first half. Um, a sloppy defensive error by Huddersfield and Wilf took took it past a couple of defenders as a shot. It was saved by the foot of the keeper, but it wasn't given. It was wasn't given as a corner. It's given as a goal kick. Get some of them. You get. You don't. It's not the end of the world. The way our corners were on Saturday, I wouldn't say we were going to do much with it. Personally, uh, talking of corners, we did have a corner right at the end of the half. Um, ben Teke got free but headed it wide. Uh, just after the half time, Lau, I want to say his name's Lau, it's spelt with the little dots above the I in his name, uh, the O, sorry, the little dots above the O's in his name. Uh, cracks one, really, really, it was a decent shot. It wasn't going in at all, I don't think. Um, Hennessy parries it. Straight into the feet of Mounier, who blazes it over, which is a surprising because he 
was the main man. Him and Moy were the main men um, for Huddersfield on Saturday. Uh, Loftus Cheek, what a lad, what a lad. Um, fantastic sliding tackle um, to get the ball off of, oh, I'm not too sure who, but gets it off of him superbly. And then pings an amazing ball over to Wilf. Good, I want to say it was about 40, 50 yards. It was a great ping. Straight at Wilf's feet. He takes it past the defender. Poor shot. Straight at the keeper. Easy save. We had another corner. Um, Van Arnholt crossed it in. Benteke with a bullet. Goalkeeper. Fantastic save down to his bottom right. Again, their goalkeeper. The goalkeeper didn't have much to do, but when he did, he did it well. Um... Another corner from us, like I said, that we weren't doing really well. This corner was really poor, but somehow um, Fosu Mensa he flicks it onto Dan, and Dan's normally really calm in front of goal. Half volley goes flying over the bar, which from that goal kick, it goes out to the right, balls into Munier, smashes it, 3 0. Another fantastic goal. Um, and it was just direct football. We're three 0 down, and we're passing it, passing it, passing it along the back. We kept going back. At this point, we're two 0 down. I'm thinking, what you, do you know? We're two 0 down, boys. Like we're passing it back all the time. Maybe that's the way Frank the Ball wants us to play, passing football. But we're not Arsenal. Arsenal were the passing. If you look back, obviously, in different seasons, Arsenal have always been the passing team. We're not that team. We've got two very, very skillful, very, very speedy wingers. Those are our outlets. We're not the passing kind of team. Um, I did forget to mention Fosu Mensah. Fantastic sliding tackle on the edge of the box. Scotty Dan. Um, really, really bad pass. Mounier goes on a run. Mensah tracks him back all the way and just an outstanding slide tackle um, that would have made it 3-0 uh, I think that was about a 60 60 odd minute something like that but it was fantastic him and Loftus-Cheek definitely definitely worth their weight in gold in that game um, too bad they're only on loan but hopefully at the end of the season might have the chance to sign them We'll see. We'll see how it goes the rest of the season. Obviously, it's only the first game of the season. Anything could happen. Make sure you check that team out on uh, on my Twitter. What I'll do, I will retweet it at six pm tonight. I'll retweet it about six pm tonight. You guys have a look, and uh, yeah, and see what you guys think. I think it's pretty good, and it, I, th I think it would work. I think it would work. Make sure you subscribe to FYP TV, guys. Make sure you subscribe to me if you fancy it, and follow us all down. Follow us there, yeah, both on social media. Thank you for watching, guys, and come on, you palace.